Yes, ma'am. You said that good. Go jump the Paris thing. There'll never be no comparison. You're live on the show. Sit back and have a listen. Lions Den. This is your boy, Coach Sheldon Harrison. You're live, live, live on the Coach Sheldon Harrison Combat Sports Show Live. Okay, guys, you know, I have to report about this one because, you know, I am going to keep my word and continue to promote the women in combat sports more so than the men. I just made a decision to do that. Now, I still talk about men's boxing because my channel started out as a, as a boxing channel, and I'm going to talk about the male boxers, but... You know, I'm going to start really pushing the women in boxing as well. I'm going to start pushing them too. So, you know, the coach has a lot of work ahead of him, you know. But I want to talk about this fight, man. Calderwood versus Cavillo. Cynthia Cavillo, she's on the fast track. She's on a definite fast track to becoming a star. Um, this girl, she's going in there and she's getting her opponents up out of there. Okay? Cynthia... Cavillo, I like her swag. I really actually like her swag. You know, she's got an aura around her, man. It's just like, okay, this girl going in there to whoop somebody's ass, okay? I mean, this girl going to whoop somebody's ass. And I'm definitely, here in the next week or two, I'm going to go ahead and reach out to Cynthia's manager, and I got to have Cynthia on the show. And I just got to get inside her head, you know, like, what is this girl thinking before this fight? So I got my homework. I got to cut out, you know, getting in touch with our manager and, you know, getting Cynthia on this show so her and I can really talk and really <laughs> just discuss because I'm really high on this, this straw weight. I'm high on Cynthia because she actually, man, this girl brings the whole fight. And Calderwood is not a slouch, but Calderwood, you know, she's been having an up and down career. And right now, Calderwood, in my opinion, she's right for the taking. Cynthia Cavillo, if she fights the perfect fight, she should be victorious in fighting Joanne Calderwood. You know, and I just got a feeling that I think Calderwood, she's kind of on her way out of the USC. And Cynthia Cavillo, she's the next thing. If she can continue to win and win impressively, yeah, Cynthia Cavillo, she's going to be a star. You know, is she ready for the top 10 yet? Not yet. But I definitely, she beats Calderwood and beats another quality opponent. Then Cynthia Cavillo, definitely in my opinion, she's going to be ready to take on anybody in the straw division. She probably need about two more fights. And I think Cynthia Cavillo is ready. I mean, this girl, she works her ass off. You know, she came from a very, very rough background. And she's had to fight and claw her way to get to where she is. This girl was given nothing, okay? That's why I really kind of admire and appreciate Cynthia Cavillo as a person and as a fighter. And the coach is definitely going to be pulling for Cynthia. You know, I'm a Cynthia fan. Now, I mean, I don't have anything against Calderwood. You know, I like Calderwood. And Calderwood, her story is very interesting, too. You know, this girl, you know, she's one of those fighters that I talked about that fighting is a big part of her income. Like, she has to fight. And not saying that she have to fight like she's stupid and can't do nothing else. Because Calderwood, if you ever look at interviews by Calderwood, Calderwood is and she's very intelligent. And she has a high fight IQ. I just think that, you know, the fighting game is starting to pass her by, and I think that she's slowing down, you know, as a fighter. I think she is. I just think the wars that she's endured in, in the octagon, I mean, so many wars that this girl's had, and I think that these wars on her body is just taking a toll. And I think Cynthia Cavillo is younger and she's fresher, and I think that she's going to be the dominant fighter in this fight, okay? And if Cavillo, if she is successful against Calderwood, you know, I definitely think that they're going to give her an opponent, okay? Definitely an, an opponent in the top ten, okay? that That's just my opinion, okay? And they might not. But I, I heavily suspect that if she can defeat Calderwood, she'll get a top ten opponent. And if she can defeat a top ten opponent, then she should be in contention for a title eliminator, okay? A title eliminator bout, you know? So if she beats Calderwood, beats an opponent in the top ten, then more than likely she'll probably be in a title eliminator bout. And if she can win the title eliminator bout, then she get a title shot. But, you know, that's that's a long way away. But, you know, hey, the future seems very bright, bright for Cynthia Cavillo. I like her, man. This girl speak her mind, too. I like it. She speak her mind. And this girl is, hey, she feisty. She real feisty. You get Cynthia Cavillo and Coach Shelton Harrison uh, having an interview, hey, that interview going to be fireworks, y'all. It's going to be fireworks. And uh, Cynthia Cavillo, 
I don't know if she's yet listened to my videos, but a lot of the women on the roster appear, just a lot of women's MMA fighters, period, they watch my videos. So, you know, Cynthia, you might be listening. The coach is finna reach out to you and your team, and guess what? You finna have the best interview of your life with Coach Sheldon Harrison. But, guys, I'm excited about this for Cynthia Cavillo. I'm excited. And, uh, you know, man, hey, and, you know, hey, do some research. You know, I probably may even do a video about, like, just Cynthia Cavillo, like how she started, her background, her life, and really just really talk about what this woman has endured to get to where she's at. I mean, she's had a very, very, it's been tough for Cynthia Cavillo, but she still managed to be here, okay? And, and really, how she grew up, she shouldn't even be at this point in her life having this kind of success but man this girl has been working and I'm talking about chipping away at the wood chipping away and chipping away and now you know she's almost arrived but you guys tell me what you think about this fight who do you think will win I got Cynthia Cavillo all the way this is your boy coach Shelton Harrison I'm done what are you waiting on subscribe to the best women's MMA platform on YouTube